For those not in the know, Let Me Solo Her is an Elden Ring player who gained meteoric sudden fame by posting up outside one of the hardest bosses in the game, with his name asking other players to let him solo her. And the name isn't a brag, by all accounts this man can solo Millennium. So, a legend is born, a player who is very good at the game gets famous for playing the game really good. Well, not exactly. Because lots of people are good at Elden Ring, people are already grinding no damage in level 1 runs. Let me solo her, I would argue, became as famous as he did in large part because of character design. He's a nearly naked man in his underpants with two swords and a big jar on his head, and the sheer ridiculousness of that adds to the story of his accomplishment. Elden Ring is a game whose bosses take themselves very seriously. They monologue Shakespearean, they are demigods of primal forces. If Let Me Solo Her had rolled up in the most blinged out super gear looking like a fantasy hero, well, that's not as good, is it? That's not as good as the ultra difficult goddess of rot getting her self important <laughs> kicked in by a murder hobo with a jar on his head. It is the comedy and the disrespect of beating the hardest boss, not only by being good, but while looking like that, that makes Let Me Solar Her such a compelling hero. Long may he reign, please don't be a milkshake duck. Subscribe to this channel for shorts, or see my main channel for longer in-depth videos.